Being diagnosed with brain cancer really changes everything. And it helped me realize that I wasn't living a life that I really wanted to live. I didn't notice that I was so content with going out on the weekends or going out for vacation once a year. And being diagnosed with brain cancer destroyed me. And all I could think about was why me? And then I reflected on my own life and realized I got nothing done. So I kept hoping that some angel would listen to me and help me just heal me and I promised that I would never live like that ever again. Uh, so here's me with a, a shunt in my brain, taking out the brain liquid. I had no idea what that meant. I still don't know what that means, but this was me right before the extraction surgery. And then after this, I actually had to relearn how to walk. Um, my balance was gone. I actually, I lost my eyesight. Uh, I, I, my eyesight got worse because of this surgery. That's why I wear glasses now. And I was working with a distribution company at the time. So after I got out of my uh, cancer surgery and everything, I went back to my job and I realized that Amazon is a lot like distribution companies, like wholesalers, but for the internet. And I told my, my old boss that I was like, Hey, I could, I could do distribution, but on the internet. And he was like, yeah, go for it. That's cool. And I became really good at it. I opened my own Amazon account and my own Amazon account was just like dummy account. And I did really kind of innovative, interesting ways to uh, grow an Amazon account. And I grew my Amazon account exponentially. And then I applied those tactics with many different other brands that I still work with to this day. And now I work a lot with individuals because after the pandemic, a lot of individuals were interested in learning how to sell on Amazon and growing their investments that they worked so hard to achieve. And this helped me work from my laptop, wherever I go. Now I'm really, here's me in Italy, here's me in Peru, here's me in Mexico being silly. And I'm able to just really live out my life now. I can go anywhere. I can go out on an adventure. I can go out to whatever country and do a job that matters. And that's what's most important to me. Not just going anywhere you want forever, doing something that matters, giving people freedom. That, that feeling that I had that my time ran out and I couldn't do anything about it. And I realized that I was never free my entire life. And for those people that realize that they're not free, that they want to be free, I can give that to them. So that's why I, I'm giving out these videos. I'm making these videos on YouTube. I have them here on the website as well. I'm giving out information that people can use to find freedom freedom from their nine to five lifestyle that I had to be diagnosed with brain cancer to realize that I wasn't free. These other people that know that they're not free, they're trying to be proactive about it. And I can give them those videos and give them the right information so they can be free. And so for those people that are, um, that, that they have some kind of brain tumor issue, they're looking at my story, seeing that I came out so well. Yeah, the University of Miami, that's where I got my surgery. I definitely recommend it. Um, it. It was like a broken arm, really. The medicine is just amazing at the University of Miami. I definitely recommend going there uh, because uh, they're really, really helping out thousands of people like me. And I do recommend donating to the University of Miami Brain Tumor Initiative because, again, um, I, I started out here and uh, I was just not happy. And after being diagnosed with a brain tumor and going through that really, really traumatic experience, uh, I ended up here and I'm able to do something really amazing for lots of people, just helping them sell on Amazon and achieving their own goals, their own dreams. And that's all because of the efforts of the University of Miami Brain Tumor Initiative.